so hello everyone my name is ravindra i welcome you to my channel in this video we will learn about how to create and develop a environment okay so i simply just uh, landed to the make dot power app and just simply sign in by using a work account okay after sign in okay in this icon here you can be able to see the gear icon okay let's i zoom it little bit so here you can able to see the gear icon so you need to click on this and here is one option admin center so simply just go click on that so you will land to an admin center okay by using this page after that okay here is one option is present environments okay so let's click on the environments okay after clicking on the environment here you have one option new so simply click on that okay give the name for your environment in this case i let's give ravi one you can select the region okay for now i kept india as it is but you can select the preview united state okay this is my own suggestion because in this you can be able to access the early features of the microsoft so that's why if you are doing this for the practice purpose in this case you have to choose preview united state okay after that here is the type of the environment so in this you can be able to see the five types okay so i will explain you one by one the environment types this question is also asked multiple times in the interviews okay what are the different types of environment okay so default environment that is created automatically and all users has the access of the default environment okay it will create automatically when you assign a license to you okay of power apps then it will create automatically and you have the access of the default environment after that we have the production one okay so production is the intended for the use for the permanent work in an organization it can be created and owned by administrator or any one with the power apps license provided there is 1 gb available database capacity thus environments are also created for each existing data was stable database when it upgrade to version 9.0 or later production environment are what you should use for any environments on which you depend and the production environment has the full control okay so you can be uh, use the production environment to access the end applications after that we have the sandbox okay those are the non production environment which offers features like copy and retest sandbox environments are used for the development and testing separate from the production provide thing sandbox environment can be restricted to admins but converting from production to sandbox environment can be blocked trial this is a uh, uh, 30 days uh, access you will get with the full control and you can be use it for the limited for the trial purpose and after 30 days it will be vanish a uh, developer environment that we are creating now it is a most and every developer has to create this okay because in developer environment we create an application most of the time so in developer environment are created by users have the developer plan license the special environments intended only for use by the owner provisioning developer environments can be restricted to admins and the developer environment will be available as long as you actively using the power apps developer plan and also one of the type uh environment is present okay it is not showcasing here 
that is teams okay if you have the team license in that case you will showcase here okay so let's i choose the developer one and here you can be you have to do nothing just click on the next here you can select the currency here just you have to provide unique domain name you can be add here for now we are not doing this simply just click on the save so your developer environment is creating okay it takes some time so in that time you have to wait okay like ravi one here you can be see developer environment preparing region we are given united state because in this case we want to do the testing and we are using this for the learning purpose that's why i use it here united state okay so in like let's i refresh it and let's see how developer environment is ready or not still preparing okay after uh, it become ready okay then you can go to the power app okay then just select on this environment okay? click here okay first i just close this and just click here you can be see here one build apps with data wars and your environment is available here you can be see your environment my latest environment is available here and here you can be see my role is admin and type is environment type is development that's all friends if you have any questions any doubt you can be asking me in the comment box keep learning keep growing keep exploring have a nice day